everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to enable Secure Boot TPM on your computer. And this is very easy to do. So you might need this for uh, games like Valorant or something like this. So let's go down to the Windows Start button and then go to Settings right here and select this. And then scroll on down to Privacy and Security. Then actually we wanna to go to Windows Update. So we wanna to go to here, go to Advanced Options. And then scroll on down to where it says recovery, advanced startup, and let's go to restart now. And restart now. And it says please wait. Now it's going to launch into a screen. And it's going to just take like 15 seconds. So let's go to troubleshoot now. That was actually really quick. Then go to UEFI firmware settings. This is going to launch our computer into the BIOS menu. So let's go to this and then go to restart. And then we can find the secure boot option. Now I have to scroll on down to my laptop because it's not gonna display on my TV. So let's scroll on in right here. Now under the BIOS menu, let's go on over to boot and find this. So here's boot and we should be able to find it under here. So we have fast boot enabled, boot configuration. Use the number pad to go up and down the arrows, and we'll probably have to go to here, UEIF hard disk. We got boot options in here. So it's not under boot on my computer. So it might be in a different location. So here's advanced, we can scroll through here and we're looking for TPM 2.0. And let's go, here's um, techno virtualization technology. This is for any kind of like uh, emulator on your computer. If you're going to be running uh, different, um, like blue stacks or something like that, get your mobile device on your PC. So let's go over here and look for it. All right, let's go back. I don't see it under here. Let's go to the BIOS update. No, let's go to main. Now my other computer is under boot, so yours might be under there. So let's go to storage information. Nope. System information. Security, maybe it's under here. Oh, here it is. Secure boot. Mine is under security. Let's press enter. And here is secure boot. And this is enabled. And we should be good here. And let's look at this one. Secure boot standard. And here is trust computing. And this is TPM 2.0 device found. Secure boot device right here. So this is enable, enable or disable BIOS support for security device OS. So trusted computing is what we're looking for. Make sure this is turned on. And then we can back out. So trusted computing. So look for that option and you should be good to go. So it says two, TPM 2.0 device found. Everything is good right there. Just enable that and then go to save and exit. Go to yes and save it and you should be good to go. Hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on your six tech.